In this video, I am going to show you how to add text box data into the video. Let me show you the design page of for this video. In this uh, design page, I added a table. Uh, when I enter this value, then I click this add button. Auto enter data that will show into this preview. Uh, let me explain the code of this. Here, you see data table dt equal to new dt. I am declaring a table here. Predictable. What is the meaning of this? This code is is nothing but when the code is executed, it's create a one table with column headings. With the column headings with the column ID. The column table column name will be M employee ID and EMP name and EMP salary. When the code will execute here, this is the uh, uh, table will be created. When the when the data row comes to you is is a null value, so there is no data row is added here. And I declare the view state. The view state is not equal to null. Then this code will be executed. If the view state EMP is null, then this code will be executed. Okay. Let's see uh, step by step how this code will be executed. When I click this add button, this code will be executed here. You see, data table dt is new data. Adding the columns here, the data row is null. Here, the view state is not equal to null because I didn't assign any values to the view state here. So obviously, the view state here is null. This code will be executed now. So let me show you. Here. Uh, let me show you the dr the dr data row is null here so what is mean of this line code is that just before i show the table employee id employee name employee id and employee name and salary when this code executes, when this code executes, this will create another row, add a new row to this column. Here, it had the txt water text to employee id water enter that will store here. Water employee name I enter that will store here I mean the rockish and the salary will be stored here and the data row this data row here you see the data dt is nothing but a table data table and row add to data row so this row is adding to this table and we are saying that data table to the review data source thus means nothing but whatever data we are adding to the data table the data is a data source for this script here means whatever the data whatever the uh, data we enter that that will store into this review and we display here now, if, now I am adding one more record so, not if you see the code will be changed execution will be changed here again the data table will be here the view state will be not null here because I assign a view state equal to dt here so whatever the first two first two row data that will be available in the view state now so the view state is not equal to null you see that now pointer enter into view if if statement yeah Let's see there is nothing but uh, the view state is uh, data here yeah, we are type casting to the data table mm -hmm. we are adding to that 
whatever data we are storing into this state we are type casting to a data table and the dt have previous uh, data whatever we entered in we stored in a uh, video that we have available in dt now if dt row is count because already there is a row here so the data row count is not equal to zero is uh, more than more than zero so this condition is true that's why entering here again the data creating one another row the second row same employee id empl uh, name the table column tagged in this second whatever we entered recently data will be added to the row and adding that row to this table again we are assigning now when i add this uh, two table data presently this dt contain two records the two records will be bind to the this video and see as you can see here now i am adding one more record so it's same okay. let me show you how many records we have dt have two count two they already have two records here in table okay that we already we have two rows are added here now we have to add it to this way like that you can add how many record you want to add to the video you can add like this If you like this video, please like, subscribe my YouTube channel or like my video. Thank you. Thank you for watching my video.